Hey guys, just got back listening to the audio from that last one. Wow, I was really quiet. Hopefully uh, this makes uh, more sense, sounds a little nicer. I know it's not going to sound great. I got a fan blowing in my face. I got uh, I got a cold. Well, it's not really cold. It's more of a sore throat. I got a place. I mean, I can, I can give you excuses, but pff, who cares? Let's just play magic. If you like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't. I really like Cranko's Command. I wish I had a follow-up with, uh, with Ray Bombardment, but that's not happening. Maybe a, maybe a forest is what I'm looking for? I don't know. Oh, oh god. Oh, why, why didn't I think that, yeah, obviously, Goblin Deck. A legitimate Goblin Deck probably beats me, especially one with that kind of a start. That's something that, uh, that really gets me. Do I want to show my black? No. No, I don't. Fuck him. Yo, I got a crinkles of my own. How about that? Which that pop is? No. Okay. Good. <laughs> I didn't. I completely forgot how that thing works. You know, I'm a complete scatterbrain. Terrible, terrible magic player. Never take my advice under any circumstances. I am not good, and he is better than me. Uh, if if this dead mouse wannabe decides to make a YouTube channel, uh, follow him. He is clearly superior in literally every way. In literally every possible way. His icon is shinier than mine. His Crinko commands are better than mine. Like, mine are gonna get... just gonna die, and his are going to, like, rape them. <clears throat> wow, you're a little late to this party, pal. Aw, oh, man. Um, I feel like the... Pl I'm, I'm not... I, I need I need more tempo here, so I'm gonna go with uh, Cranko's command. I gotta, I gotta unleash my hand right now. Maybe, maybe I can steal a Rabble Master with this and, and swing in, because, I mean, he's going to be swinging in hard, right, Raven Farm? This is almost my deck, except it's mono-red. So if you can make my deck mono-red, that's him. That's Dead Mouse. Dead XX Mouse, I think. Mouses, really. That's weird, actually. Now I don't like it so much. Do I want to steal that stupid fucking thing? I don't think I do. Uh, boy. <laughs> I'm actually not sure what I want to do here. I can swing for three, and then get a, a token, a counter on that. Um, I don't think I will. It's weird. It, it, it's pro <laughs> He is swinging with this, though. That's the problem. He will be swinging with this. Uh, <clears throat> if I block... Alright, well, Cathari Bomber has to come out now. I'm not sure what my play is going to be. If I... If I... If he swings with this, should I block with my Cathari Bomber? Because then I'll get a 5-5 five five out, and that'll, that'll make some short work of his shit. On the other hand, do I want... I mean, oh, well, that, he made the decision for me, didn't he? <laughs> oh, so, again, sorry for the snorting and the coughing, guys. I'm like... Ugh. I've, my girlfriend was sick for like a week, and now I'm sick for almost a day. <laughs> it's unfair. Um, yeah, well, he got me, man. I mean, I don't think there's a whole lot I can do at this point. I'm, I'm pretty fucked. This guy definitely got me. Uh, good job. I've, I, I really hate all tribal decks, other than maybe slivers, because they're multicolor. But, uh, you got me. He, he did it well. I... I mean, I need blockers. I don't have blockers. I, I could swing... Oh, well, this thing dies. At least I'll have a 5-5. Five five. I don't think... I mean, there's no point to swing with a 1-1. One one. He'll just take it. He won't give a shit. <clears throat> At least I can kill one of them? I can kill them both. Or t two of his things. I mean, I'm taking three minimum next turn. Probably more than that. Oh, what the hell am I saying? I'm taking more than three because of Ray Bombardment. I, I keep forgetting that it's over here. It's this forgotten little enchantment. Enchantments are so strong in this format. And nobody runs enchantment destruction. Oh, hello. Wow. He's a good player. Alright. Good. I'm glad. <clears throat> now let's drop this shit. Okay, I can dump out the 3-1 uh, again, or I can take one of his things and swing with it. Um, not going to be doing the latter. That's stupid. 
I don't have any way of killing it. He's getting it right back. I'm going to keep these two fuckers as blockers, and I'm going to swing with the 3-1. And if he wants to make a trade, I'm super duper happy with that. Please trade. I, yeah, obviously going down to 13 is a better move. I have no anger of the gods. I have a pretty shitty wall that I feel like he can easily bust out of. I mean, turn one or two quest, and it's, it's, it's tough for me. I mean, I got my own shitty quest. Here, look. It's, it's got a zombie in it. I, I mean, I got a zombie. <laughs> I think yours is better, though. <laughs> a lot better. Oh, hey, at least I got him thinking. At least it's not like a typical boring-ass tribal game where you just play the n biggest one in your hand. Oh shit, no, that was... that was completely wrong. And, and once again, I should remind you that I am a bad player. And you should not listen to me. Uh, I have no choice but to blo uh, chump block here, because there's really no reason not to. <clears throat> now is this board wide? No creatures you control, son of a bitch. I mean, I could just take him, but what the hell am I gonna do with him, you know? Like, there's, what's the fucking point? And then he's just coming right back, and I got this shitty little wall, which isn't going to make a difference. I mean, all I've done is ensured that he's not swinging with this. He can still go with the 5-5 five, five and the 4 twos. And at least he's not triggering a raid bombardment anymore. That's nice. I'm pretty fucked here, though. I mean, we're even on, on health-ish, but he, he's got me. I mean, I, I don't have a... I don't have a doubt in my head that he, this guy's got me. If he decides to put down a, a few more lands this turn and drop a uh, Inferno Titan, I'll be happy. Shocking this guy, huh? <clears throat> I'm not sure who I should be hitting. Um, I mean, I can kill everybody. There's no point. I, I gotta hit him in the face. Oh, but he's got me anyway. I'm dead. Alright, good game, man. Yeah, you win. He just swings in. Alright, well, lost to a better deck, better player, better everything. Uh, this man, uh, I'm gonna have to mail him my, my girlfriend, and my cat, and my clothes, and cry naked in the streets until my next game. <clears throat> I'm sorry I let you all down. Uh, I feel terrible. Let's get another one. I like that feeling. I want to do it again. Uh, yeah, you're different. Odd Megan. That is a great name. <laughs> Odd Megan. Beautiful. That, I mean, you don't need the underscore, as you can see from my name. Oh, Odd Megan. You're so odd that you don't play Magic. Oh, you do! Good. Good, I'm glad. I mean, you, you paid... I don't know how much you paid for this game. Hopefully not too much. This is a great hand. It's got all my win conditions other than uh, Active Treason, and instead replaced it with a uh, shitty quest for the Grave Lord, which I cannot ensure will come out. <laughs> this is a bad hand. Well, it's not... Alright, no, that's not true. It's not bad. It's just not ideal for what I want. I want a little more tempo than this is going to give me. Um, at least I got two plays next turn. Uh, what would I take? God, I don't know what I would take. Maybe the Raid Bombardment. Probably the Raid Bombardment. Or actually, maybe the Blasting Station, because it can take out... I have no idea what he wants. Probably not one of the Goblin Arsonists. Because I have two. Maybe a quest. Because that's actually a playable. He's got a good... I'm not sure. Okay, he took the Raid Bombardment. That's my first first uh, thought. Um, I mean, it's... Good. <laughs> Great. Well, I mean, it's good long-term. I mean, he knew this was coming. But... Uh, but d don't you expect that that thing is going to be dead by the time Rape Apartment becomes relevant? I would imagine. I might be wrong. I don't know. I really don't know. I mean, I think the best benefit of this card is that it lets you lets him look at my hand. The, the stealing a card is helpful in some situations. I think most of the situations are not helpful. And that's, that's decent. Gain some life and everything. But he knows I'm running... <clears throat> he knows I'm running Rape Bombardment. Maybe he wants to save it just for something a little nicer. He also knows that I have uh, Blasting Station. I mean, of all the enchantments and artifacts that I have, that's the one I would rather have destroyed, frankly. Yeah. 
I'm actually not as upset about that. He has, there are a lot other, there, there are better choices that he could have made, in my opinion. I mean, this can turn into a 5-5, five five, but it's not, I mean, it, it, it's, it's not for a while. And it doesn't trigger on any of my other shit. Hmm. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna goblin. I'm gonna goblin. It feels right. It feels right in my soul, and I listen to my soul. Uh, do you think this is a life gain deck? Some kind of Orzov, like... What am I gonna be looking at here? What do you think he's got? I mean, he's running this, which I don't blame him at all. This is a great, a great card to be running, especially in this format. Really important. Some of the big, a lot of win conditions are enchantments and artifacts, so that's just all around. And then you just get four life because fuck you. Hey, how about an angel? <laughs> old Megan is a uh, oh, odd Megan, looking more like old Megan. Slow on the road in the mind, if you know what I mean. Yeah, nope. Okay, no. Yes, I have two goblins. Now she has a play. That's what this pause is. She's wondering whether or not to play it. If if she didn't have a play, it would go straight into end step, and then it'd be my turn. But since she or she's zoomed in on a card, let's hope that she's not zoomed in on a card. Just went for a piss break. Let's hope she's thinking. Maybe she thinks it's my turn. Maybe she forgot her second main. Yeah, you know what? I got a friend who I let play this game every now and then, and he he doesn't always remember to hit the uh, the continue button. And that's probably what old Megan the Mastermind is doing. The Mastermind is a pretty conceited... I mean, talk about blowing your own fucking horn for a title, huh? The Mastermind. I like the Traveler. Traveler's nice. It's uh, it's not, like, threatening in any way. It's just like, yeah, I'm going on my own. I'm, I'm over here now. I'm over there. Who knows? I don't know. Do you know? No, you don't. Now, now I'm questioning things. Um, if I drop a blasting station... I can get that Ray Bombardment back, but what's the point, right? I might as well just drop a Ray Bombardment and say, fuck you. If he wants to pop that, that'd be great. I mean, that's, that's a lie. It's not great, but I don't mind as much as uh, Blasting Station. Blasting Station, each one of these is two damage spread out however I want, so that's way better. This way, I'm getting him back down to uh, under 20 again. He's probably not going to block because that's not very favorable. Although he should. He should block. That would have been the right move. Next turn... It depends what he has, but I think I'm actually going to drop Sprouting Thrinax over Blasting Station. <clears throat> well, I don't know. I mean, if he's not going to block, he might as well attack. Did, did, did Megan forget? Don't worry, Megan. I'm, I'm with you here, baby. You can do this. You and me. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. It's completely your fault. Oh my god. Megan. Please. Alright, well, anyway. Um, yeah, I'm thinking Thrinex over... Well, I mean, because he could clear the board. Oh, you know what? Fuck this. Yeah, I'll play this too. Should I do this pre-com? I'll do this pre-com, just in case he wants to block. I don't mind one bit. And then I'm swinging. Let's see what Megan wants to do. Megan's taking a little bit of damage. I think it's the right move for Megan to block, personally. Because then I'll only have one. Alright. Well, I mean, she'd be cutting my damage in half if, if she did that. But since she didn't... Uh, drop into Thrinax. <clears throat> well, that's not true. I was going to drop a Thrinax anyway. Three, man. I mean, the only color that I'm truly, truly terrified of in this format with this deck is red, because Anger of the Gods just just rapes my needles, man. I mean, I have no more teddy bears left. I, it's all my milk money. I'm, I'm just... What I'm trying to say is it, it shits on my beans. I just lost Blasting Station. That's too bad. I did not actually see that coming, even though I definitely should have. I mean, he knew it, right? He saw this. He saw this when he first went through. <clears throat> he's in a lot of trouble though because he's taking he's taking two at least 
And if he'd like to block, then he's taking another one. Depends how he blocks, really. I'm going to keep that in hand now that I know he's decided to uh, fuck with me. I mean, if he's going to go discard and shit, he should have gone to Mirror. Because then you can get that uh, thing that lifts a permanent up and then he has to discard something. What was it, for six? For five? I don't remember. I don't remember everything. I remember very little. Don't do drugs. Eight. And he hasn't touched me at all. I don't know why he's not swinging, then. There's really... Oh, well, I mean, I guess last turn he could because of this Thrinax, but... I'm not sure what he expects these things to be doing. Uh, any one of these is a bad idea. Alright. <clears throat> I mean, that gives me six more damage on the board, you realize, because of, uh, of Rainbow Bar. Well, actually, it's three more damage. And then you're going to swing in the air for the only damage you can do. Yeah, dude, this isn't this this isn't gonna work for you, man. This is lethal right now. In fact, this is completely lethal, and you're dead. I mean, I I would have won without that top deck anyway, but he's totally fucked now. Fuck it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I only had to hit him with two. I I don't know why what he was thinking there. I mean, did he not read the card? I, I get three more tokens. I get three tokens. And they sink with fucking Ray Bombardment, so that's coming all at your face. He would have been way better off with the... Uh, actually, he would have been better off not playing that. He should have just blocked. He, he should have been walling off. Or she, I suppose. Odd Megan. That was an odd play. But uh, I appreciate your generosity. Yeah, she wasn't very generous. You know what I'm worried about in Origins? Um, what is this guy talking about? I hear like a heartbeat. Alright. Did you hear that? I don't know if that even came up. That was weird. Um, I like it. I got my domain. I got a rabble rabble. Rob rabble rabble rabble. He's got too many cards. I like everything about this. This looks like a win to me. I don't really like winning. I mean, that's not entirely true. I don't like face rolling. It's really boring. And that's kind of segueing into what I don't like about Origins, because when Origins drops, you have incentive to win all of a sudden. In in all the past duels, you play just because it's fun, you know? Like, maybe you're going for the rank, alright, maybe, but most people don't give a shit about that. They really, really don't. So when you make a deck and when you play other people, you're just doing it for the fuck of it, you know? You're, like, throwing things together and, and trying to have a good time, trying to f smash some faces or do whatever the hell you want, you know? They're doing it for the lulls. But in Origins, it's not going to be like that. You, you get directly rewarded for playing well. And that that means that there's going to be a community that's a little more hostile towards quote-unquote bad decks or decks that are, you know, suboptimal. I think the Krenko is just where I'm going. <clears throat> and that's going to force people to start playing sort of the same deck. I mean, they're going to find what the meta is, and they're going to say, okay, so in, let, let's say uh, Boros Tokens is the best deck, and you get the more, most consistent wins with Boros Tokens. That means every guy you're going to be playing is going to be playing fucking Boros Tokens. And, I mean, it's going to be a real pain in the ass. I mean, a whole meta is going to be going around that, and, and everyone who isn't going to be playing Boros is going to be getting yelled at and shit, and it's just it's going to be hostile, it's going to be shit. He's got a shock open, doesn't he? Does he have shock? Do you think he plays shock? I have no idea what he's playing. I'm gonna hold off on the. Oh, I have a, another rabble master. Yeah, fuck it. If he wants to drop a shock on it, I don't care. I have a whole other one right behind him. Yeah, I mean, it, it makes me feel bad. Like I want, I want variety. You know, I don't want the same deck winning over and over and over again. Even though there is like a best, but here it's not rewarded. In Origins, it will be rewarded. That's the big difference. I don't know. I mean, maybe it's... I mean, I, I, I'm talking... I'm criticizing something that I've never even played. I've never even been into yet. The community is, doesn't even exist, so maybe I'm full of shit. I, I'm probably full of shit. I'm almost always full of shit. Don't even listen to me. Don't listen to me. Listen to Murderous, by the way, who I have not, uh, who I have not mentioned. And since he... Oh, boy. Do you think he's got mass removal? <clears throat> you think he's got mass removal? I bet he does. But the problem is, do I care? Yes. Yes, I do. 
If he was below 10, I wouldn't care. I'm going to swing real hard now. This is going to be massive. He's Actually, maybe he'll... No, no, he can't kill it. Alright, I could have dropped the other Rabble Master, and it would have been more damage. I'm not going to play anything else, though. I'm, I'm, I'm going to expect a board wipe soon. That could be a board wipe. Oh, did I call it? Did I call it? <laughs> yes. Oh, man. Knew it. <laughs> I, I could have dropped Grinax, but I think that's a mountain right there, and that kind of got me scared, because if he dropped another mountain, he could have angered. Um, this is obviously the play, and I think that's all I need. I think he's dead. I'm not even gonna, I'm not gonna play anything else, because I have, I have the win next turn no matter what he does. <clears throat> Good game, man. Good game. I assume it's a good game, unless he makes a bunch of... I mean, he hasn't really done anything, frankly. And, I mean, I said I don't like face rolling, and I believe I just face rolled. I mean, he's playing some kind of a control deck, right? I mean, he's been ramping. It's some kind of a control. These aren't really control... I mean, green isn't really control -y. Maybe he just has this for the, uh... the... the... the cultivate? <laughs> Ground Assault doesn't matter, unless you have another one. <coughs> You're still dead, dude. I mean, I love you. I mean, no matter what, even if he somehow kills this. Aim fire for one, that it doesn't matter. I still have him dead next turn. And I'm going to show you this shitty little trick that you should, like, never play. Unless he can stop it somehow. Which he might. He might be able to stop it. No, no, now we cannot. All right, so that's that's the game. I'm gonna say good game to our opponents because we are good people, and we promote good behavior. And I'm not gonna use blasting station. I'm gonna use active treason to give my little bitch haste, and he's gonna go bite him in the nets. Murderers got murdered. Sorry, man. Control decks, you know they're. I, I, I generally rip him apart. He did not reciprocate my good game. Make me feel bad. But I'm not I'm not I'm not gonna slip my wrist about that, you know? It's okay. I mean it's it's alright, it's alright. I'm not actually <clears throat> I'm alright. I'm alright. Hey, let's get a new game. Uh whoa! Holy crap! Um You know Oh god, I, I would. I really would, but not <laughs> Wow, I was not expecting that. Um, yeah, I'm not going to do that. Not today. Uh, some other time. Some other time. I, I, I like those kind of games sometimes. I, I liked them a lot more uh, in 2014 with Two-Headed Giant. I liked... Uh, God, I don't know. I, I don't, I don't want to talk about 2015. I'm, I think everyone's on the same boat. We all understand that 2015 was not the glorious days that they were claiming to be. It was a huge disappointment. Even, even the producers were sad, man. I mean, every nobody wins. When 2015 launched, nobody wins. I'm going to keep this. <clears throat> um, I think um, ordinarily I like dropping this down early before creatures, but Elvis Visionary is going to be uh, looking for a land for me. Even if I get another land, I still want to be on point. I like having up to four lands. Generally, I mean, three is required, and I usually get that no problem. Usually, but um, but I I like there's a safe comfort zone when you have four. Okay, Elvis visionary and a visionary, so let's just keep digging. I mean, I do want three. <laughs> <clears throat> Fergus, interesting. Interesting. And, and I say that because I'm wondering if I want to drop Quest of the Graveyard Lord to try to trade a Farrakas with a Visionary, which now that I'm saying it is obviously retarded. He would just take the one and then swing himself for one. So, um, yeah, yeah, he's not... He's not gonna... No. Uh, I do hope I get a Swamp here. I think that would be the best draw. That is not a swamp, I don't think. Last I checked, I'll have to contact wizards. 
Uh, does anybody know their support number? Um, anybody. Uh, please leave it in the comments. I do not know it. Oh my. Uh, it looks like it's going to be a raid bombardment, actually, because I have to... Well, wait, what am I kidding? Quest for the Grave Lord. No, because I can play those. I'm only going to be playing one. You know, nah, that's not happening. <laughs> uh, is he swinging? I... I... Pff, him? I don't think he would. Actually, yeah, no, no, no. His 1-1 one, one is a little better than that. Uh, Jesus Christ, this is a mess. Okay, I'm actually fucked right now. <clears throat> I'm actually really fucked. Uh, God damn it. Okay, well, I'm, I'm dropping the Krenkos. I'm dropping the Krenkos. He doesn't have any mass removal kind of shit. I'm getting hit for two, at least. I really hate facing Orzov. I think it's one of the weaker weaker color combos in this format. What the fuck? Really? Okay. I mean, don't you think I have better cards than that? Alright, whatever. I mean, you can get rid of one completely, so, I mean, it just gets him a 2-2, but... You know what? Fuck it. That was a decent play, I guess. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna bitch at him. I'm not gonna bitch at him for any of that. There we go. <clears throat> so, uh, what do I want to do with this? Uh, I'll tell you what I'm going to do with this. I'm going to start dropping these things, because these guys are going to die real soon. Do I swing here? He'll take the three. No, he'll take two, and then he'll swing for a lot more, so no, there's no point in doing that. point. I, I really need another land. <coughs> I am taking that too, obviously. This surprises no one ever. I mean, right now he's winning. I'm, I'm mostly land fucked. Maybe I should change the mana curve a bit. Um, Ray Bombardment is not exactly what I'm looking for in a woman. Uh... But I will be swinging now with two, and only two. This is strictly to prevent one from... Wow, he took it. Why? If I had a shock, I'd pop this thing. Huh. Maybe he just doesn't want the counters to come down. And he is watching damage effects, so I'm sure that's actually the case. Uh, new players tend to overvalue or undervalue this card. Oh, but who, who am I kidding? Of course, they tend to do that to every card, don't they? Uh, not sure he's going to swing since he didn't block. So I would imagine... That, I mean, uh, he'll swing with it. I'm, I'm talking about the uh, Banisher Priest. But uh, at this point, he's clearly winning the race. He really likes those damage effects. Um, Jeez. Alright, uh, I guess I could start winning my own race. And I'll start doing four, and then I'll try... This will help me catch up to him, but I really have a feeling I'm looking at some major life gain uh, coming up. <clears throat> I have a feeling. I mean, not Pelaka Worm. Pelaka Worm? Pelaka? Whatever. But, uh... I'm sure he's got that Convoke Gain 8 Life garbage. And he's got damage effects on. Kiss, by the way. Good name. Good man. Hello. Sorry about that. My uh, my cousin just got online. Oh yeah, of course. Of course. You know, I saw one guy arguing that this was that this is one of the best uh, decks, uh, the one that's centered around this this card. Oh, best decks in the format. Um, that that is incorrect. <laughs> that is that is completely incorrect. Oh. Yeah, don't mind if I do, and I think I'm actually going to swing better, better right now. Because I do have a, a blocking, jump blocking creature. And I'm actually winning the race right now, unless he's got... I, I, shouldn't, I shouldn't say that. I mean, I'm feeling very good right now. I, I've just stabilized, but 
I'm late on that stabilization, so he's very likely to be dropping some shit on my head. And, I mean, I got a lot of hair on my head, man. There's, It's going to be weeks before I can get that smell out. Nobody's going to let me sleep in the bed with them. I'm on the couch for the next couple of days. All right. I wish I could do a little extra five damage to him. I also wish that they didn't like damage effects as much as they do. But I do have a chump blocker here who is resistant to removal. So I think we're okay. Unless he can... I mean, 12 damage, it, it's possible. It's possible. Uh, not... Ooh. That's... <laughs> that is not going to help you, actually. <laughs> All right. That is not going to help you. Because I believe you turns to me when this fucking giant becomes my bitch. And she is a huge bitch. So I'm going to call that game. Thank you very much. And, oh, oh, God, I've been waiting so long to show you guys that Act of Treason does belong in this deck. <laughs> I don't know if that justifies it. But uh, let's pretend it does. Also, is it an evening when it's one of the triggers of Raid Bombardment? I mean, I know I have more coming, but it ends now. So, I'll say I evened him. I'll give myself the brownie points. I am high on the count. And I'll see you next time.